Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed the new Yankee workshop with Norm Abram. It was fantastic. The number of tools and the way he used them really does make that job uh, go quite a bit easier. Obviously, it, it, he didn't do it in a half an hour. There was obviously a lot of uh, preparing uh, the, the project, but it was a terrific way to show you how to get involved in work and woodworking. Norm does a terrific job, and of course, you'll see him a little bit later in uh, this old house as well, which is coming on next. If you enjoy this kind of programming, then we're asking you to, to help us out right now during this, our Festival 90. My name is Tom Endress. John Scheffler is here, and we have a great group of operators from the Fresco Bank. They've driven down from places like Rogers City and Hillman and Lachine and are offering a great challenge grant here this afternoon. This is the first year in a couple of years when they've been able to make it because they've been snowed out. So they really, they want to make up for lost time. They want to really be busy down here and they want to talk to you. So why not give us a call and make a pledge and support great programs like the New York Yankee Workshop and this old house on CMU Public Broadcasting. Call now with maybe a pledge of $5 a month Maybe a pledge of $25, but if you enjoy the great how-to programs on Saturday here on CMU Public Broadcasting, then please do your part and give us a call. John Scheffler, how you doing over there, guy? <laughs> well, uh, you got some free got, blue cards there and yeah, all kinds yeah, of stuff I, going on. I think the uh, the folding table uh, segment is <laughs> oh, coming up either next week or the week after. Yeah, well. I, uh, I saw the promo for it I here on the public television ahead. station yesterday, and I thought they meant today was the day, but... Well, we'll have to keep watching the, the new Yankee workshop and see what else old Norm comes up with. It'd be nice to have uh, a relative like Norm around, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> well, so you could make the and, stuff, uh, or, or, you should, or so you could borrow the tools? Oh, well, either. It doesn't make any difference. <laughs> I borrow some of those tools. I might even be able to make a straight cut on a 2 by 4 but it's uh, the kind of carpenter I am. But uh, Norm sure makes things look easy, and, and the thing is, when you know how, and he's certainly sharing a lot of that knowledge with us in the proper tools, which is, of course, okay. the ultimate, uh, of ultimate importance, uh, having the right tools to do the job. Uh, when you have people like Norm uh, showing you things like that, well, it's going to make your job go a little bit easier. And uh, we hope that if you are a regular viewer here of the new Yankee Workshop, you'll give us a call and uh, tell us how much you appreciate having that program here on CMU Public Television, 1-800-727-9268. Now, let's see, we have a call which uh, came in from uh, Marion Thompson of Lachine and wants us to say hello to Sue and Kenny. Who are Sue and Kenny? Who are operators here? Oh, down on the far <laughs> side there. Okay, Sue and Kenny. Is she hiding over here? We said the official how-do there. Then uh, we got a call from uh, Elma Nevins of Posen. All right. All right, up in the old neck of the woods up there by the uh, Preskill Bank. We also heard from Harold and Joanne Brand of uh, Barreton. And from Hillman, we heard from Roger Longpree. And in Millersburg, David Smale. And we appreciate uh, those calls, which have helped us out here. And uh, hope you'll do your part, too, today. That's right, John. Oh, and I, I've got a brand new member of the individual honor roll. We want to show you who that is. Walt and Judy, we appreciate your call. And we're going to be adding your name to the Wall of Fame. And you can join them as well by calling 1-800-727-9268 and put your name up on the Wall of Fame as well. Make a pledge of $200. You can put it on your Visa or MasterCard. Maybe you'd like to uh, pay that off with, uh, say, a $25 a month until it's paid off. That'd be great. Just talk to one of our operators here. We're here to serve you. Public broadcasting, commercial-free public broadcasting deserves your support. Call now at 1-800-727-9268. I also got a call from a great friend of ours, and I really appreciate it. It was good hearing from her. John, you've got some more uh, honor roll cards. Yes, I do. I've got a new one right here uh, from Carl and Audrey Lowe, I believe it Leo. is. Leo? From Leo. Is that Leo then? <laughs> that was Leo. Carl and Audrey Leo from Roger City. Then uh, Riley and Mary Lou Turcotte, some old friends of ours uh, from Petoskey. And Richard and Norma Straka from Harrison. And Charles and Debbie Beckwith up in uh, Sheboygan. And uh, these will all be going up on our... Uh, Wall of Fame here over my uh, left shoulder. We've got a few names over here already, and uh, we'll certainly see that list uh, continue to grow here throughout Festival 90. And we'd like to have your name up there if you and your family enjoy public television and uh, can see fit to uh, donate $200 here as an individual uh, honor roll. We'd love to have your name printed and share it uh, with all of our viewers around Central and Northern Michigan. Let them know just how much you appreciate our service here. 
And uh, there's Tom. He's got the old microphone in his hand, and he's going to meet some more of our operators. Yeah, that's right, John. You know, these people have driven a long way, and, and it's been a couple of years since they've been on, and we want to make sure that, that everybody gets to meet them. So let's meet a few of them right now. Hi, what is your name? Audrey Selke. And Audrey, where do you work? I work at the Presque Hill Bank, uh, Rogers City, main office. Okay. And in the accounting department. In the accounting department. Okay. Keep everything in balance. Good. <laughs> Glad to hear that. Somebody's got to do that. Somebody's got to do Make it. Sure, everything's right. <laughs> right. Okay. Anybody out there you want to say hi to today? I'd like to say hi to my husband, Kadon, and my daughter, Holly, and son, Tom. Okay. And where would you like to get some more calls from today? All over. <laughs> all over. Anywhere. You can just talk to anybody, right? Really? Okay. All I have to do is give you a call. That's right. All right. Thanks for coming in and helping out. Let's see who else is here. Hi, what's your name? Jamie Koenig. And Jamie, where do you work? <laughs> I don't work. <laughs> hmm? I don't work. You don't work. Where do you go to school, Jamie? Hillman. Hillman School? At the community school. Great. Okay. And your dad, of course, works for the bank, right? He's down on phone one over there? Mm-hmm. And before we go, we're going to say hello to uh, John and Cindy Dalkey. Very, very good. I got the nod from the big guy here on phone one. And that's in Nesson City. All righty. And uh, they also want us to say hello to Tim Trezice, I believe it is. So we've taken care of that bit of business. And now the next bit of business for us here today is to go see what's happening on this old house right here on CMU Public Television. <laughs>